In this video I'm going to show you how to set up Audacity. Uh, the only complication really, uh, I mean it's just installing a normal application, but the slight complication arises in that you have to install um, a little add-on that lets you use MP3s. And that's going to be essential to us in creating podcasts. So I'll take you through the process. So all you do is go to uh, Google and type in Audacity, and it'll be the first one that comes up, audacity.sourceforge.net. Straight away at the top you have the download link. So we're going to download that. So I've just clicked that link. Now I'll ask you where to uh, save the files. So I'm just going <clears> to <throat> save it in my uh, downloads folder. So this is my personal downloads folder. If you're on a university computer or similar with a My Documents, then save it to somewhere that you can write to. So save it into your My Documents or onto a temp drive or similar. So I'll just save it there just now. And then because I'm in Chrome, the little pop-up down here um, shows up. But uh, if I just show in folder, you can navigate to whatever it's saved and open it up that way. So I've got Audacity at the top there and that's the newest one down here. So I'm just going to double click that to run it. Hit run. Uh, so it just asks you to select the language we're English just now. Uh, and next, go through the buttons. Pretty much all of the defaults will do the job. That just popped up because I have installed Audacity in this computer in the past, but you shouldn't get that. And install, and it'll go through the installation procedure. Now, the next thing is we need to download something called uh, LAME and that is what allows us to encode MP3. So I'm just going to pop back over, while that's installing, pop back over to the Audacity window and I'm going to download LAME while we're here. Now um, on this page you've got other Audacity downloads for Windows. I'm going to click that and in this list you'll find LAME. So Windows, recommended downloads, it's got the install installer that we just downloaded at the top but if I scroll down a little bit you've got plugins and libraries and here we go LAME MP3 encoder and that's what we need. So I'm just going to click that and then it takes me to instructions, how do I download and install and this isn't some instructions you could follow through if you like or just Go to the download page here and then eventually we get to a download link. Now don't click this big download link here because that is an advert for something else. What we're looking for is the link for LAME itself. As it says here, LAME library downloads below, not the banner and this is the banner here. So we don't click that, keep scrolling down and then you get to here where you've got LAME for Windows. So LAME 3.99 for Windows. Click that and that should download the application. I'm going to save it to the same place. So that's me in my folder and downloads. Click save and that's it downloading as well. Now I'm going to pop back over to my Audacity install and it's got to this stage now. So click next and click finish and that will start up Audacity. There we go. Uh, but because we're going to install LAME I'm going to quit it again. You could have clicked a little tick that said launch Audacity and it wouldn't have launched it. But what I'm going to do is now click the LAME install and then install that. So click run, click next, next. Again all the defaults should be fine. This will be a bit quicker. Click finish. Okay so that's that installed now. So the next step is let's get Audacity back up. So I'm just going to run Audacity now. 
So that stays now in my start menu and I can run it just normally through the start menu. Here's Audacity. So that's us all set. Lame's now installed, Audacity's now installed. The only thing that can happen at this stage is when you go to record your uh, audio file and then export it, if you choose to export as MP3 occasionally, um, Audacity won't pick up that you've installed Lame and it'll ask you to tell it where the Lame files are. Uh, now all you do then is you navigate to your C drive and then Program Files and then Audacity and the Lame files should be in there installed by Lame. Alternatively, there's a chance it might have installed in a separate folder, in which case it'll be your C drive, and then program files, and then lame for Audacity. And in fact, I can navigate just over there just to show you. There you are there, that's the lame file there. So that is your C drive, program files, the Audacity folders here, so you can check there, or you have a lame for Audacity here. And then the Audacity will just be asking for the location of this file here, lame underscore enc dot dll. And as soon as you tell it where that is, that's it all synced up. And from then on, Audacity can export MP3s, no problem. Okay, so thanks for watching and uh, good luck with the recording.